I didn't test it to see if it would capture, so. Oh, wait a minute now. Okay, it says press space. So this uses keyboard. I'm feeling it. I'm, I'm kind of liking it. That was kind of nice. <laughs> Options. Okay. Play. Let's play as Terra. Oh, enter to shoot up to six shots at a time. Clip. Hold space to fall slower. Okay. Uh, let's do medium. Enter in space, okay. So I wonder if this is like one of those. Um, this is actually a uh, go go ahead star. So yes, it would be kind of like a bandana. Okay, I'm kind of feeling this. Would be lovely if they could add controller support, though. Just because it feels a little weird for me. Okay, that's our life. Okay, I'm liking this music. Like, it's really nice. And again, this one is available. Right. It's like, that's kind of odd to me. I would much prefer it to be shift. I don't have enough coins. I would have much preferred it to be shift and, um, shift in the space bar. We'll do medium again. <laughs> All sexy gays need you to enter. <laughs> but this is pretty cool. It's pretty much a rudder game, so... You're just kind of... Running, or as they would say, running gun, I guess, in a sense. Technically. But yeah, I'm like... Would have been lovely if they could have, uh... Made a controller support as well. Looks like the level changed too. Which is cool. Oh, Tingu. Tingu spirals, that's what it looked like. Let's try again. Yeah, see, that should be to where you could actually kind of cross over. Yeah, I think I've seen Hellbound. I'm gonna have to look it up again, but I think I've seen or heard of it. This is actually pretty cool. Kinda digging it. Kinda digging this one too. Like, I kinda like it. Cause, oh, well, we died. That was my fault. <laughs> we'll play a little bit more and then, um, like I said, I'm gonna get ready to see if I can find someone to host. That's true. It, he does, he does. That, 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 yeah, that is, that is very true. <laughs> you didn't get a coin for that. Screw you. Tingu, bats. That hurt. Got that. I didn't have a choice. That what I didn't also have not those 
But I'm kind of digging this. This is actually, and like I said, this is free to play. It is available on Steam. So if you're liking what you see, I would say definitely pick it up. I'm kind of digging it. It's kind of one of those games. Not a lot that you do. But like, to be honestly truthful, even though it is free to play, I would have gladly paid a couple of bucks for it. To be honestly truthful. Because this is like... You don't get a lot of free-to-play games that are done very well. And even though the control scheme is a little odd, with the space bar and the enter key, still not a bad game, though. Damn, that happened. That too got screwed again. And then I like that it's one of those games where you can't go back and you have no choice but to go forward. Our first boss, it looks like. Oh, yeah, I would have definitely probably paid for this. Yeah, I would have gladly paid, right? Like, I would have gladly paid for this game, to be honestly truthful. I mean, my only thing is I would love to also have kind of like, um, oh yeah, we're going to restart that because <laughs> we got kind of far. But I would have liked to, uh, yes, let's continue. Oh, I thought I died again. And then too, my only other thing is the, um, the fact that it uses the enter key, which is a little weird. But I can see why it wouldn't use shift. Because if it did, it would, you know, close down the game and stuff because it brings up the sticky keys notification. So I see why they didn't choose. Um, to use like the shift key or control key or anything like that. No! Dang it! <laughs> yeah, exactly. I know I'm not gonna do that one, so I'm gonna hit no. Uh, let's go to the shop. That's coming soon. But yeah, because I would have gladly, like I said, gladly paid a couple of bucks for this. I'm actually kind of enjoying it. And then too, like, not trying to be funny, it kind of reminds me a little bit of Mega, a little bit, with the fonts and stuff, but... I'm like, this is actually done very well. So, honestly, I hope the developers for this game continue to kind of keep going with it. Because I would love to see what comes out of this. Like I said, easily, and even like Terry just said, no, she's not naked. <laughs> she's not naked. She's wearing her armor. That was a good save. But like, there's so many game, bad games being released and, and people want to charge like a dollar for them and it's like, no, I'm not going to pay a dollar for a game that's not going to hold my interest. But this, because uh, the music is great and, you know, the game itself is pretty cool. I would easily pay maybe a buck or two. I'd say about a buck or two for it. Because you don't do a lot, it's just simply jumping and shooting. So it's not like you're doing a lot. 
But I would pay like a buck or a dollar ninety-nine USD for this. So there's a bundle I'm actually considering picking up on Fanatical and it has like Double Dragon Trilogy in it. And I haven't played the Double Dragon games in a while. Oh, different boss. Different boss. Uh, yes, I do believe it was one of them. Um, and then they ended up re-coming out with the one on the NES, and it was the same as the arcade, but they had one that was not as good as the arcade version of it because they did revamp they did re-release it though that I do remember what do you have give me, okay so I can pause this give me a quick second Yeah, that's true too, but then again, they do have other modes. We can check those out in a moment. I'll check out the other modes just to see if it gets harder. But don't forget, they do have like a hard mode and I think an extreme mode. Good music though. And then it just started raining here, so probably get ready to call it. Oh, I was like, what the heck? But we could try a different mode and see if it gets harder. So this is just medium. I wasn't gonna do easy mode. Here comes another boss, it looks like. Oh, he's adorable! Well, that happened. <laughs> R 
yeah. <laughs> Just uh, Shauna, right? And then flavor. I'm like, uh, okay. Um, let's continue, I guess. And then, like I said, I'll try one of the other molds. Cause I'm like, if this is medium, this is actually quite easy to me. So I'm curious to see what the other... And I've kind of wondered if they have any other parts to the game on here. Oh, taking a lot more damage. That happened. Okay, so I'm gonna try a different mode. He was, he was adorable. He was. <laughs> so I'm gonna try to play it again. We're gonna play with Terra. Select. And then I'm gonna do hard mode. I'm not gonna do endless, but I'll do hard mode. Your fault is brutal. It's brutal with that autocorrect. Uh, like this music, so I would love to see. I'm gonna see how hard it is. Something that would be cool on, you know, for the developers to do. Okay, well, I wasn't paying attention. Yeah, autocorrect is brutal. Um, let's play, because right now the coins are only used to continue. So I'm hoping that, um... You know, kind of hoping that later on. Okay, we're gonna slow it down. So we're getting ready to probably come up to one of our first bosses. I like, cause it looks like it's supposed to be nine stages. So I don't know if, you know, okay, see that's new. Yeah, that's new. That's new. Still relatively kinda easy, but it did throw some stuff. Yeah, the song is nice. Looks like I might be coming up to a boss. Kappa ship! Okay, bosses get a little more... a tad bit more difficult. If you blow up the platform, you're screwed. Sounds like it's getting ready to storm. But yeah, so that was it on hard mode. But yeah, this is Mecha Tokyo Rush.
Right, a kappa ship. That was pretty awesome. So definitely the developers have to be... I hit try again. I didn't mean to try again. Developers have to, without a doubt, be from Japan. Uh, because the kappa is really big in Japan, so...